Les forces armées canadiennes sont en déploiement à l'heure actuelle en Lettonie, où le Canada remplit le rôle de pays cadre du groupement tactique de la présence avancée renforcée en Lettonie. L'exercice Crystal Arrow a été mené récemment à titre d'évaluation de la préparation au combat de l'OTAN dans le but de valider l'efficacité du groupement tactique sur le plan de l'exécution de manœuvres de combat. So, exercise Crystal Arrow was really the culmination of uh, our first four months here, uh, and it was designed to bring all the different subunits uh, within the battle group together to be able to do tactical tasks, offensive, defensive, uh, transitional operations, but together as a battle group, uh, working for our larger brigade structure. Uh, so we had the 10 nations of, of the battle group, uh, which are Canada, Spain, uh, Italy, Poland, Czechia, uh, Slovakia, Slovenia, uh, Albania, North Macedonia. Macedonia and Montenegro uh, and then we're working alongside the Latvians, uh, Danish uh, and there are Americans participating in this as well uh, and uh, Iceland. So 14 nations in all took part in this exercise. We teach the units how to build pits, how to do trenches, how to protect themselves and also how to use the different mines here in the battle group. Comanta Multinational Company is a challenge not only for the language but also for the procedures. Integrate the support company in the battle group is also a challenging thing because we know, we have to know how to work with different countries, with different uh, companies and with different procedures, all in the framework of the NATO standards. Uh, so some of the challenges, I mean, the weather, uh, it's been challenging. Uh, you know, we've gone hot, cold, snow, rain uh, out here. It, it's been unforgiving. Uh, some of the, the big challenges, um, again, just working through the language barriers, working through the, the radios, the equipment, uh, you know, 14 nations coming together that haven't worked together before. Uh, there's lots of reasons why it couldn't work. Uh, we'd never worked with the, the Danish before. We hadn't worked under a Latvian brigade before. Um, so there are a lot of things that were very new to us uh, on this exercise. Uh, but we're really surprised me and, and impressed me uh, more than anything was that all of our soldiers, our non-commissioned officers, our officers were able to just work through all those challenges at the lowest level uh, and just work those things out on, on their own uh, to make the exercises a success. We learned a lot about how the Canadians uh, way of do a pit and it's quite different, quite different between Spanish way to do it. It was a very good experience. Absolutely. Um, each of the nations here has had a different experience, uh, different operational experience from you know myself in Canada. So they, each one of them brings something different to this. We all accomplished the task and in, in you know the ultimate objective, the uh, the same objective, uh, but they all do it a certain way that's different. So it's been really interesting to learn that way uh, and to learn from their their military experience.